guys, welcome. Welcome back to Artistic License. Thursday stream starting at 6. A little bit of what I want. Katie wants to always play with her. So hyper. I had to give her <laughs> a sparkly toy so she would stop knocking down my lights and everything else in my life in my room. <laughs> oh, guys, y'all, we have a fun day. Well, fun, and then I'm probably going to butterfly mini game. No mod. Um, if I remember properly from when I did this previous version, pretty difficult. It's supposedly easier on the HD, but we're playing. We'll find out, but I definitely need your person. And, in addition to that, little person. So. There we go. That's the personality quiz that we're doing. So here's the personality. Pokemon. So this is like an astrological type. <laughs> uh, so we're going to take this Pokemon type. Play something. <laughs> All right, we fixed it. All right, so let's start this. All right, the first question: Are you procrastinate slash avoid something else? Uh, yes. Why? What does it matter? Really, I am, but not this time. No, I do. My I don't necessarily do my work on time. I'm not, I'm not like specific procrastinate this. Um. <laughs> So I think the answer is why. What does it matter to you? Gaslight. Gaslight, gatekeep, girl boss. Um, it is unfortunately overused term for some. Yeah, I do see a lot of people misuse gaslight. That's true. Aren't those old just use electric lights? I have no idea how to answer this. Uh, yeah, that's what my blank did. I haven't seen that play yet. Was it a play? I thought it was a movie. Oh, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, we're going with Gaslight Gatekeep Girl Boss. I like my microphone. Hello. Let's jack that up. There we go. That looks more normal. Now it looks like it's really loud. Let me turn you guys down just a little bit so I'm not blasting y'all out. Okay, there we go. That looks normal now. All right, pick a place to be alone. Mossy forest, snowy mountains, isolated cabin with a small garden beside a river, surrounded by people in a city, but mentally alone. Ooh, inside my head. Oh, I like that. My bed, an empty museum or art gallery, a library, an abandoned house in partial ruin, a beach. Oh, we're going with the beach. We're going with the beach. I like that. All right, favorite starter Pokemon. <gasps> Pikachu, I choose you. Derogatory. Oh my god, that picture. Okay. Favorite starter, where are you? I hope you're on here. Fennekin. That's going to be, yeah, that's all. That's all they did. Okay, so yeah, definitely Fennekin. Look at this thing. It's a cute little Firefox. Like, how could you not love it? Looks like it doesn't have the latest gen. <gasps> hey, Moisty, how's it going? Isn't it late for you? Shouldn't you be in bed, my friend? <laughs> <laughs> well, since you're not, you should do this Pokemon quiz with me and tell me what um, type it gives you. And yes, uh, Lady is keeping everyone entertained in the background. I'm hoping she'll calm down and get in her regular spot. And then if somebody wants, we can turn on the baby cam and y'all can get a nice, good close up look at her. I'm trying to keep her from knocking everything down. That's what she was doing earlier before the stream. Okay. Astrological sign. I am a cancer. What is this? I don't know. I guess I'm better <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Who doesn't know what their sign is? Okay, anyways, I'm Cancer. What type do you think you are? Oh gosh, I don't know. I would probably I would probably go with water or fairy, maybe. I think we're gonna go with fairy. Um probably but just saw you live and said I haven't said hello in ages. Oh well I appreciate it. Of course I do, Moisty. Hang on, I'll send I'll put the link in the chat. There we go. Tell me what type of Pokemon you are. Okay, we're gonna mark fairy. All right, pick a card. 
King of Diamonds, Ace of Spades, Five of Diamonds, Joker, Jack of Clubs, Queen of Hearts. Ace of Spades. I like the Ace of Spades. I don't know. I've always felt an affinity for the Ace of Spades. Not quite sure why. Uh, do playing cards have, like, meanings? I don't really know. Okay. Grow a plant. Lilies, buttercups, a lemon tree, herb garden time. I kill everything I touch. Maybe a succulent will be okay. Hibiscus. I actually do. I really do not have much of a green thumb. Um, I can only grow things if they're like outside in a garden and the weather basically just takes care of them. <laughs> if I was like indoor plants when it's all on me, like I can't do it. I just kill it. I don't know. I don't have a feeling about when they should be watered and when they shouldn't. So I always like over under, you know, I mean, if you're not good at plants, you know how it goes. All right. So I kill everything I touch. That's the answer. Dogs or cats? Dogs, cats, both are great. I'm a fucking, I'm a fucking bird person. <laughs> Um, I really do love both, but I have a slight preference for cats. I, I love kitty cats. I, I have, I love my kitty cats, obviously. Like, look at Lady back there. I can see her in the, like, little slobs preview thing, you know, where I can look at myself and I can see her in the background just running back and forth on that bed. There she is. Okay. Bye again. <laughs> okay, cats. We're going with cats. Spiders. Um, don't want to talk about this subject. <laughs> Uh, gross, disgusting, zero out of ten. No, uh, only non-venomous ones, please. I got bitten by a red, black, silver, spinner, funnel, web, blue, gray spider once and I almost died. Holy crap. Um, it was cool, though, like a roller coaster. Anyway, do you want to drink pure gasoline with me? Oh, boy. <laughs> uh, spiders are cute and often harmless. I have 112 spider facts prepared. Oh, where? I'm creating a spider army. This tarantula on my shoulder is called Steve. Say hi to Steve. Um, I don't really have... None of these really speak to me too much. I guess I'll go with the 112 spider facts because here's the deal. Um, I'm not a personal fan of spiders, but they can stay because they eat the things that I um, hate more, which is mosquitoes mostly. So spiders can stay because they'll eat the mosquitoes, but there was only, really isn't an answer that like uh, has that vibe. So we're just going to go, they're cute and often harmless. They're not really cute, but they are often harmless. So there we go. What's your role in the friend group? Mom, friend, joker, uh, disappear off the face of the earth every so often. Designated driver, the only actual extrovert, person who needs mom, friend to order food for them. I definitely am the mom friend. Like, let's be real. Pick a color. Yes, I spelt it like that. Americans. You know what? You know what? I can't see color colorblind, and I don't want it to affect my results. Oh, oh. Oh, fancy colors. Okay, we've got wine red, bright red, dusk orange, sunflower yellow, light green, forest clean, green, turquoise, sky blue, ocean blue, indigo, violet, lavender, pink, black, brown, white, or silver slash gray. Going with pink, of course. Yeah, some of these are kind of tricky. That's why I love you quizzes, because they're like, you never quite know what you're going to get in there, you know? Some of them are really off the rails. <laughs> um, what is your ideal main Pokemon companion? A cute Pokemon that can sit on my shoulder like a Meryl or a Jigglypuff. An intimidating large Pokemon like Charizard or Tyrantar. A friendly companion who will walk alongside me like a Vulpix or Bulbasaur. A useful travel Pokemon like Lapras. A rare or even legendary Pokemon like Articuno or Sukun. An original Gen 1 favorite like Snorlax or Pikachu. Definitely this one, a friendly companion who will walk along beside me like a Vulpix or Bulbasaur. That is totally my vibe. I don't do the free text questions, as y'all know. Okay, psychic. Okay, I'm, I'm not mad at that. Like, that's cool. I'm cool with that type. Okay. You got fairy certified vibe. Oh, yes. You're so a fairy type. I love that for you, Moisty. Okay. So you're not soft. You are brought up in a way that allowed softness. Not really. You're not strong in a way that other people see much, but you're still stronger than most people. Be gentle with yourself. Oh, thank you, Quiz. I will be gentle with myself. I like this. This is a good result. This is a good result. Okay. Um, thank you for doing that with me, Moisty. Apparently, the quiz also tells you if you do it twice and try to get a different result, that's like your, uh, then you'll be dual type with uh, those two, you know, like a Pokemon. Okay. Let's switch back to webcam for just a second while I get our game going. Okay. We can close this. Let's turn up the volume. Look at the levels. Oh, it doesn't look like y'all can hear it. Hang on. I know what I did. I know what I did. I was messing with my sound. 
settings earlier trying to fix some things and um yeah i did stuff i shouldn't have done i guess here we go now y'all can hear it all right turn my controller on so i know i said last time we would start out by going and get more of those um, smiggards that were rare in that area. It turns out we were in the right area for capturing those. However, um, I don't know how long doing this butterfly minigame is going to take. So we're actually going to go do the butterfly minigame first because I really want to try to finish that this stream. Like see if I can actually do both parts this stream. I'm sure I can do one of the parts. It's just whether um, I'm pro gamer enough to beat both parts in one stream. That's what I don't know about. So we're gonna try. We're gonna try. Like I said, I've heard that the butterfly mini game is easier on the HD version, which makes sense. Like you can probably just see the butterflies a lot better than you could in the original, you know, fidelity version. Since this one's HD, then I guess you can see them better and, and that's what's up with that. So we'll find out if I, if I find this easier than previous runs that I've had on uh, on this game. So let's head over to Makalania. That's where we have the butterfly mini game. You'll probably remember me briefly pointing it out when we were here back several episodes ago. But um, yeah, let's override that. Okay. Okay, we gotta look for the man to talk to him. I guess he's at this end. Oop. Wait, I can send food. Yeah, Moisty, have you seen that before? I found it on somebody else's stream, and I added it to mine. Um, no one's ever actually used it, and like, I don't expect you guys to, especially on like Thursday night. <laughs> I tend to go to bed like pretty soon after stream, but um. I do think it was really interesting, that so I added it to mine because I thought, like, well, that's fun. If somebody wants to do that, they can, you know, so I put, like, some snack things on there. Um, you should definitely add it to your stream because I would think, like, for maybe for longer streams, it would be really fun. And I thought, did I, like, just walk past him? Oh, no, there he is. There's the man. I guess while we're headed there, we can get some captures. In. There's the Iguodon. Um, this is Moosru. <laughs> meow, I hear you, kitty cat. Can y'all hear that kitty cat meowing over the microphone? I, I know y'all can see her. I can see her in the in the thing. What's up, lady? Yeah. Can you lose your toy? Can we throw it again? Hey, lady. Look at this. Look. It's so shiny. Oh my god, it's so shiny and sparkly. It's so shiny. Oh, it's on the bed. Yeah. Oh, are you done with it? I threw it on the bed. It's right here. Oh, it's right here. There you go. She loves the really sparkly ones. Oh yeah, hell yeah. I'm here for some bubble tea. Um, I I'll have any bubble tea, but I love the classic taro. If you know what I mean? Oh, that's a wasp. I think I didn't mark off the other wasp that we got. Um, oh, those are... I need my... I need walk out here. I think... Called? What are they? Blue element? Oh, no. Not waka. It's Orin, but that's okay. He's up. Get him, Orin. Those are blue. Wada. Titus, just don't skip your turn. Here we go. No time oh, a tarot fan. I feel so out of place in bubble tea places in UK. <gasps> really? I don't think so, Moisty. If I think about, like, you know, people I've seen around here. Oh, apparently I missed a chest before. Some Phoenix Downs. Um, I don't think so. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's just different here. I do feel like I've, I see people, you know, of your look. <laughs> At, uh, at bubble tea places here. Um, but maybe it's just different in the US? I don't, I don't know. Get this wasp. Enough. All 
All right, we're getting some captures no up. That's good. Waste. Kendra! Go. Kendra, it's been forever since I've seen you on a stream. Oh my gosh, I've missed you in here so much. How are things going with everything? I know your shit has been like a total roller coaster, so I'm sure that's why. Yes, you are. You are definitely here. You know what? No, nobody's nobody's claimed first yet this stream. I'm surprised. A company finally left. Oh my oh, goodness, hi. I'm free. <laughs> oh, I know that feeling. I know that feeling. It's uh, it's nice having company over, but there's a certain point where it's like, I'm done with you guys. Get out of my house. <laughs> you know? <laughs> okay. Hell yeah. Coming in with the first. Okay. Iguodon. It's another one of you. And then, what is that? A blue element. And more Saru. Enough. Smash or pass rock monster. Um, most of them, most of that design, I would say pass. But this one, I would say smash because he's like all sparkly. Okay, so the butterfly that changed color attract the red and blue butterflies. Red butterflies are ill omens. Get too close and they will summon deadly fiends. Blue butterflies lead to good fortune. Find seven and treasure will be yours. So I have to get seven blue butterflies without um, hitting more than one red. If I hit more than one red, I, you can't make it. Like, you just can't get the timing. Yeah, y'all watch the cat because it's going to take me several attempts here. And um, so, yeah, I'm just going to fail over and over. And I really won't be able to watch the chat while I'm doing it. So, yeah, y'all be entertained by... Be entertained by the kitten. Okay, we're gonna try. I was too slow. There was one more. Didn't get it. But I didn't hit any red ones, so that's good. That's, that's uh, that's something. I think? Oh no. The colorful one's not here. Did I get all seven? Hang on, let me go to where the chest is. I don't think I did get all seven. Also, three days later or whatever from when the miracle worker ad was surfaced to me and I'm still getting TikToks about it. The Harry Potter shaking his thing. Oh man, that TikTok was awesome. Okay. Do I not? Hmm. What is happening? I'm not sure what I did because the colorful one's not in its spot anymore. Also, I notice I'm not getting any encounters. Maybe go talk to the man? Did I actually beat it first try and just not remember what happens when you beat them? <laughs> oh, lord. Luck is a fickle thing, traveler. Find the blue butterflies as quickly as you can. Yeah, I don't think I did it. But the color one's not here anymore. And there's not a chest in that spot. There's just a blue butterfly. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I did it. This minigame's hard. I mean, it's going to take me a few attempts. Normally, it would take me a few attempts, so it's fine. Okay, here we go. I'm going to try to count this time. One, two, damn it. That's a uh, Iguodon, 
a wasp, and a moose. Enough. No time to waste. Let's go. Three. Four. Five. Damn. I got lucky the first time running through that little area without catching anything. Let's see, this is a Zephos. Okay, and two wasps. Meow, yeah. I know, kitty cat. I know, lady. What's up? How are you doing today? Katie, welcome! Oh, thank you so much. Just send me your pro gamer energy while you're lurking. Told ya. Um, that's what I need right now. <laughs> it's exclamation lurk. Yeah, oh, damn it, I hit it again. I didn't get it this time anyway, because I hit two of them, so I knew that. Zephos. <laughs> oh, Kendra. TikTok is such a time sink. This is the problem. So if I get in the habit of it, it's like really hard to break the habit, you know? Yeah, there's... When I'm on TikTok, I consume a worrying amount of TikToks too, Moisty. So, um, yeah. <laughs> All right. Attempt number three. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Ha ha! Oh no, but I ran past the thing! So I don't get credit! Motherfucker. As soon as I get that seventh one, I have to turn back around. Okay. <laughs> Y'all cray. Yeah, I have a TikTok. I I post I have actually made a few TikToks, like legitimate TikToks, and then I have also um a lot of like my videos advertised on TikTok. Um which didn't really work. It really didn't drive traffic to my channel. BT dubs. Uh cuz I'm just not very good at TikTok. <laughs> uh and my stuff just isn't very TikTokable. So that didn't work out. That's oh, blue element. Maroostaroo, there you are. Yeah. They're very cute, legit TikToks. Thank you, Kendra. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Okay. I'm remembering why this one is so hard. Because you have to, as soon as you catch that last one, you have to stop moving. Or you'll go to the other screen, and then you lose out on getting it. Alright. That's Chimera. No time to waste. Let's go. I'm too wordy for TikTok. Oh, uh, you just you just have to script it beforehand, as far as the wordiness goes. Um Kendra, you just gotta script it beforehand and then you can then you can be less wordy. Alright, so that's a Zeophos and two wasps. Um, well now you have a new follower. Did you used to create content specifically for TikTok or was it content from other sources turned to TikTok? So I did both. I had a lot of content that was um, YouTube videos turned into done. short versions for TikTok. And then I also have some actual TikToks on there that I made for TikTok. 
Mine are made to close, but the one I made organic would perform better. Yes, I do agree with that. That's what happened to me too. All right, kitty cat. I am doing some some real pro gamer stuff, so I don't think you can sit up here. Where's your toy? Where'd that toy go you were playing with? Where'd it go? Okay, well, anyways, how about this one? How about this? <sighs> okay. One of mine blew up and hit a trend at the right time. I literally brought no extra traffic. <laughs> yeah, I have a couple of YouTube videos that perform very well um, based on Google searches that people make. Um, they don't actually, it doesn't grow my channel, but those particular videos, it's the how to build a roleplay server on Discord. They perform very, very, very well compared to everything else on my channel. Oop. Oh, Chimera. I got 450,000 views on one, pretty much gained nothing on Twitch. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's how it kind of seemed like it was going for me as far as making TikToks goes, which is part of why I got lost interest in actually making them. I still love browsing TikTok. I just, when I do it, I spend too much time on there, so I try to not. Yeah, it's very Tumblr-esque. Okay, next attempt. Three. God damn it, I keep missing them. Three. This is a failed attempt. Four. Five. <laughs> Lady. <gasps> That's right, meow into the microphone. Yeah, I knew that was a failed attempt. <clears throat> Tumblr talk. Meow, I know. Okay. What are you, where'd that toy go? Lady, where'd that, are you getting tired? Are you getting tired? Okay. Let's try again. It's two. Three. Four, five, six, seven. Ha ha! I did it! And I didn't run off the damn screen this time. See the babies? Okay, Katie, we'll turn on the baby cam. But she's not sitting up there right now, but I feel like she's going to move there at some point when she gets sleepy. We'll turn it on. Okay, that's one of the mini games down. So you can see I got a teleport sphere. So I got to beat the other one to get the Saturn sigil. <laughs> Thanks so much. Officially midnight here. Good night, Moisty. Have a good sleep. Okay, where's the other butterfly to trigger the other mini game? Around here, out of my way. Out of his way. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's a Iguodon. And blue element. Enough. I do feel like after doing the first one, I That's agree with done. some people's assessments that on the HD version it's quite a lot easier than it was on the you know playstation rendered graphics version hey lady oh why don't you get on the camera why don't you get on the camera baby i don't know if she's gonna want to stay put <laughs> i tried she instantly moved <laughs> um we'll see all right, where's the other rainbow butterfly? I can do the other one too. Meow, I know. Is it over? It's not over here. I love your pants, what the hecky. Oh yeah, they're like white stripes, see? 
white and gray stripes. <clears throat> yoga pants. I always wear yoga pants if I can. The only times I don't wear yoga pants is when I'm not allowed like to work and um, things like that. All right, this is a wasp. Oh yeah. We're almost done with the wasps and we've got two blue elementals. She stretched her leggy real far. <laughs> oh, she is doing that. Lady, go get in frame of the other camera so they can see you bigger. She does not care about my stream or being entertaining. <laughs> she just wants to be herself. Oh, stop hitting it with Titus. There we go. Yeah, Kendra, I think I got these off of Amazon. But gosh, it was a while ago. And it was one of those things where I just searched yoga pants and I found one that had decent reviews and then I bought a bunch of colors. Chimera! Kia! Farewell. <clears throat> All right. Where are you, Mr. Other Butterfly? I guess I just really don't remember. <laughs> oops. Oops, oops. Uh, we'll find him, though. In the meantime, we'll capture a bunch of stuff we gotta capture anyways. And there's a blue element. Okay. Farewell. I should probably get some new yoga pants, speaking of. And I need some new fuzzy warm socks as well. These are starting to get messed up on the bottom, as they do eventually do. Okay, let me try going up here. Go down this way, just kind of reorient my mind. Maybe I can find the other butterfly. Don't worry, we'll come back to you in a little bit, little area. That I just walked past. Hopefully with the Saturn sigil. I love this little area. It's so beautiful. I can't imagine ordering clothing from Amazon. You're so brave. No, really? I mean, yoga pants, like, they're mostly gonna fit. I'm gonna save again since I beat that one butterfly minigame. There we go. Okay. This one, the first butterfly, is behind you. There's one. Two. Damn it. I didn't see that one. Chimera. I mean, it depends on what clothing it is. Like, I wouldn't order shoes from Amazon, you know what I mean? But, like, yoga pants? Yeah. I'd order that from Amazon. Because they're going to be stretchy. So it's all good. I wouldn't order, like, blue jeans from Amazon. You know, stuff like that that's... The size really matters. I must have hit another red one. Now, one thing about this butterfly minigame, like, it looks like they're moving around and, like, you have to dot, like, really pay attention to where they're going and dodging them, but it's an illusion. They're just flying up and down. They're really in the same spot because this game, of course, is the camera doesn't move. So while it looks like the butterflies are, like, moving around the course and you have to, like, whoo, 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 you totally don't. They're really stationary as far as Titus and the camera's perspective goes. The movement they're doing is just up and down, which... We can't move the camera or anything like that. We can't move up and down. Like, it's fine. It's like a trick. Damn it. It's like a trick a lot of people use is they pay attention to where Titus's feet are on the, um, on the path. And that helps them. Okay. This should be all the wasps that we need. 
And there's another Zeathos. That's awesome. Look at you dance around the butterflies. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. This is the harder route. We did the easier route first. Um, this one's a little bit more of a challenge. So we'll see how many attempts it takes. If I can even do it on stream. All right. Failed attempt number one. Let's try again. One, two, damn it, I keep hitting that butterfly. I gotta get more to the right when I go up there. There's an Iguodon. Um, Roosteru. That should be the last one of those I need. And this should be the last blue element that I need. Heal him more, Titus. Good job. <laughs> this doesn't add to your time, by the way, fighting the monsters, but when you hit the, the monsters, um, it does end up adding to your time because Titus has this little animation where he crouches down, good, yeah? and that does freeze you for, like, a fraction of a second. So you definitely don't want hit to hit the red butterflies. Your time is very limited as it is. Ah. <sighs> All right, we don't need any of these guys. Oh, yeah. But you can't run when you hit the butterflies, so we just gotta kill this. <clears throat> wow, Titus actually died. That was rude. Farewell. Farewell. All right, <clears throat> trying to get comfortable. <laughs> this is a failed attempt. I did this little section way better last time. Take a potion, Titus. You're tired. Enough. Thank you. Yes, please. No Pray to the Let's gaming go. gods, or really any gods that would care about gaming. Um, because I need their I need their power. Because I'm not I'm not doing good on this run. I mean, I knew it was a failed run, but I wasn't like trying to do bad. But I'm not I'm not bobbing and weaving this little section well at all. I'm hitting every red one. Lady is sleeping, but she's not sleeping in the optimal position, so I think I'm going to move the camera so that y'all can see her a bit better. Because this is, this is definitely a failed attempt. Okay. I think I marked off that kind of There we go. Farewell. Yes, I know. Capture limit reached for all of these guys. Let's go. I'm done with them. Yep. Okay. Let's move this baby cam. There we go. She's so regal and majestic, <laughs> laying there. <laughs> okay, now the baby cam is for real. I'm getting what you paid for. Okay, let's try again. 
Eating that first one so fast bake gave me some confidence. I feel like maybe I'm a little overconfident now. I'm not paying attention the way I should on this one. Damn, that was too much to the side. This is another failed attempt. I should just start this one over and not try to complete it. Don't say that. Don't say that, Oren. Uh, thank you so much for the lurk, Kendra. You know, we always appreciate our lurkers around here. Glad to have you. Alright, let's save so that I can heal those guys up. And let's go back. Alright, let's try again. That last attempt, that wasn't anything. We pretend we didn't do that. <laughs> and mess up in the very beginning like that. Okay, one... Two, three, damn, I keep hitting that one same one. All right, that's enough chimeras. That's how it's done. I feel like there's not a butterfly there, and yet I keep hitting something, but I don't see one right there. I don't know what's going on with that little bit. No bueno, no bueno, no bueno. We try again. I keep thinking it's it's in the back, but that one's actually in the front. Okay, we're good on Iguodons too, apparently. thing that kind of sucks about this little bit is when you run into the enemies you cannot flee so I have to actually kill them all <laughs> even though this is now useless to me because I already captured all these Oop, don't attack nope don't attack with Titus Ugh. funny he just goes again there we go goodbye blue element I'm on a roll <sighs> oh yeah I 
there's another Zeophos. We need one of those. So we need some of those guys. And I think that's the only one in this little Makalania area that we need. We have to go to the other part of Makalania for the others that we need. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> I'm just not, I'm not even reaching the end on this one. That is not good, not good. And this one, it, like, it makes you start, like, backwards, so that's so weird. That's part of what makes this one harder, too, because you... I don't even know what I hit. What did I hit? What did I hit? Mystery. No idea. Titus Y. Ooh, Daredevil. I don't think I've noticed that overdrive before. I should probably swap Titus out because I keep getting those blue elementals and he can't really do anything about those guys. We're gonna start this over. Start over, start over. And let's do Kamari here instead. That'll be better. There, now full health. Okay, let's try again. Attempt number five or something like that. I don't know. Counting's hard. Say your prayers. It's all. Oh, good crit, Waka. We still do need a few more um, seed pros. Four of them. Yeah, we need four of those guys. Okay. Okay, let's practice let's that go. little gauntlet that I'm bad at. Okay, up, no. We have to go up, down, up for those two, and then down. Okay, so for the first two, I need to be up. For the third one, I need to be down. Maybe it's back up. This one's back up and then down. Okay. And then left, right, left. And down. Yes, there's a butterfly right there and I'm just not seeing it for some reason. I feel like I got a little farther, slightly farther than normal, or than I was doing. 
All right. Let's try again. <laughs> that little spot. Oh. Smash your pass on the Zeophos, this guy? Smash. Faux show. Kendra, I thought no you were lurking. Waste. Let's go. Damn. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Oh, welcome back then. Happy to have you back. Is Eliza hanging out with us today? I thought I dodged that one, but I did not. Oh, she's watching True now, so fingers crossed. Ooh, okay. Crossing him. <laughs> she just needed a snuggle. Aww. Well, glad you're there to oblige. Alright. I'm getting kind of close to the end. I just, I really gotta keep, stop hitting the red ones. I mean, duh. That's the whole point of the minigame, but, you know. Took her on a mind tour, and that was a mistake. Oh, like it was scary? For her? I thought Eliza doesn't scare, afraid of anything. One. Two. Fuck. Two. Three. Damn. Oh, too boring. I'm sorry. Sounded like something that would be fun, you know? She has to go on the zipline tour. Hey, ziplines are awesome. I do enjoy me a zip line. Urgh, this little gauntlet. Oh, three, oh. Yeah, maybe not. <laughs> okay, I think I only need one more Zeophos. Yeah, so he's up. So I'm gonna go up, down, that. Oh, no, that one previously was the last CFOs. Okay. Left, and then right, and then left. And then inner corner. And then... I keep hitting that one. Enough. I gotta go to the left at that point. Hmm. Let's go. Yeah. Similar spot as I made it to last time. <laughs> Kill me. The things I'm doing for you, Kamari, so that you can have your ultimate weapon. I hope you appreciate. Alright. Mm. 
It's just all this. Oh, he didn't escape. Really? Uh, okay, I guess I'll kill them. I was trying to let you guys go, but you said no. So we're going to destroy you now. Daredevil. I guess that's like being in fights with low health. You gets you Daredevil or something. Hmm. Excuse me. Okay, let's go. One. Two. Three. Fuck. And I switched down too quickly. Ow. Farewell. That's four. I gotta make that smoother. Five. <clears throat> Six. Seven? Oh, I was so close! It was right there! <sighs> Motherfucker. I actually felt it within my grasp that time. But where'd Lady go? She's somewhere else now, not in the baby cam. Alright, let's save. Everybody can get their health back up. I'll move the baby cam so y'all can see her again. That's a good view. Okay, let's try again. We got so close that last time. So, it's probably gonna happen. I'm probably not gonna totally fail at this and not be able to get it. I think I'll be able to get it. Thank you so much for following Nixon C. Welcome to the stream. You get to see in this stream truly what it means by me being bad at video games. Thank you so much. I do think I can do it. I do think, I mean, I know I can do it. This is, I've done this before on the harder version. It's just that, you know, on the old graphics, it took me way over two hours to finish this. That's why my question is like, can I do this on stream? I'm not sure, but We've only been going an hour, and I already beat the first one, and we're on the second one now, and I got really close that last time, so I do feel like I can do it.
<laughs> That's another butterfly I keep hitting. Stop making the same mistake over and over again. That is annoying. <laughs> That's how it's done. <clears throat> I'm so close. I'm like right there. And I, I run out of time before I pick up the last butterfly. That's the second time that's happened. Yeah, um, Lady loves like shiny sparkly toys, like anything that catches light like that. So she loves that fluffy thing because it's got little sparkles in it. Meow, yeah, I know, Lady. What's up? I mean, you can't be like rambunctious while I'm trying to do the butterflies over here. So you gotta... You gotta go somewhere, do something. Okay, you can be down there, that's fine. One, two, three. Really not going to messing it up. Four. Nope. Messed that up. Messed it up this time too. I'm hitting too many butterflies. Enough. Ah. <sighs> Hit that butterfly again too. I see y'all's questions and comments. I'm gonna get them after this run that I'm about to fail. If I could hit just like maybe one less butterfly, then I think I can reach that last blue one. Um, I'm waiting for her to take your ears. So that's why I have the other ears not displayed anywhere. They're like kind of hidden because she does like to eat these ears. Both the kittens like to eat these ears. Um, so you did the 200 dodges and chocobo challenge. Yes, but we cheated. We used a mod to beat those. Because no fucking way am I doing the 200 lightning bolt consecutive challenge um, within two hours. And I'm sorry, but I'm busy. <laughs> I'm not a kid anymore. You know what I mean? I ain't got time. And the chocobo thing is just, I find it super frustrating. So when I realized there was a mod for it, I was like, fuck yeah, we're going to test out this mod on stream and instead of actually doing the challenge. I mean, you can find people legit doing the challenge all over YouTube if you want, so. One. Two. Three. in the same spot again. I guess I don't know how to get past those ones right there. With the help of two Red Bulls. <laughs> uh, yeah, Nixon C, it's a... Uh, oh my god, it takes forever. What, like, loser decided it they needed to be 200 consecutive lightning bolts? Like, that's a human rights violation. I can't, I can't handle it. Farewell. Yeah, we did do a little bit of Q&A, because we just kind of hung out and waited for the mod to do the work. Four, oh, missed it. Four, five, Fuck! I'm so close and I can't get it. 
Yeah, we just hung out and chatted. I don't really remember what we talked about, but maybe it was like a little q and A. I I don't, I don't recall. But I know we, we hung out and did something fun. There's a roadmap for the butterfly hunt on Google. It's in Japanese, though. Yes, I'm aware. I've seen it. Um, I know it exists. Oh, wait. I didn't... I need to heal these guys. Um, so, yeah. I mean, I kind of... I, I know basically what I'm supposed to do. But that one part, I keep thinking I'm doing it, and I'm messing it up somehow. I don't know. Looking at a map and doing it on the screen are, like... Sometimes doesn't always translate in my brain. But this isn't a new game for me. I've played it like like a ridiculous, stupid amount of times. So that's why I, I it's done. It do kind of know what I'm doing. Yeah, and she I found the hiding spot. No, 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 baby. Lady found the hiding spot where all the different color ears are. <laughs> where's, your, where's your thing? What'd you do with your toy? Oh, you lost it? Okay, hang on. Oh no, here it is. Wow, you are destroying this thing. Hey, where'd you come? Right here. Boop. The bed is getting absolutely covered in fluff from that thing. <gasps> okay, let's go again. <clears throat> Get comfortable, okay. One. Two, three. Oh, almost. Almost got through the gauntlet. <laughs> hit that one. <sighs> What's up, lady? Oh, don't. No, no, no. You can't press random keys. Go back over there. I'm on a roll! Six. Seven. Ha ha! Ha! I did it. I did it. That took way less time than I thought it would. It was only 7.45. Here I come, sad and sigil. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I got it, I got it, I got it. Apparently a chest I missed last time. Whatever, I got it, I got it. Got the sad and sigil. The mini games in this game are ridiculous. This one is no exception. But I do agree with what a lot of people said where the HD version is easier. Yes, this is way easier. Way easier than um, other versions of this game. Hands down, 100%, no contest. On the PS2, that game was way harder because it was just straight up harder to see the butterflies, you know? So this was definitely easier. Lady, what you doing up there? Yeah, I don't want you up there. You know that. Meowing at me. Okay, let's do it. You have the celestial weapon. Yes. power has grown. Yeah, we're doing it again. Is there anyone else's celestial weapon we can turn in right now? I don't think that there is. 
So we have, like, Lulu's sigil and crest, but we don't have her actual weapon yet. The weapon attains its maximum power. Now then we can do, we can do one part of Orin's, but just not the other part. Why are you meowing so much, baby? What's up, lady? What's up? Oh, bits are not working today. There's an error? Oh yeah, I heard some people were having struggles with the stuff in Twitch. What, what are you trying to buy, Katie? Maybe I can make it happen another way? Okay, we gotta go to the other part of Makalania now for getting the rest of the monsters in this area. And then hopefully we'll have time to go back and get the Smiggards. They were super rare, so I don't know, it was taking forever. Alright, let's board the airship. Um, I was gonna make a sound effect and then I was just gonna cheer, but it says bits are, are, aren't available to be used right now. It also notes they're safe. Okay, that's weird. The final show so it makes me think it's a no it's a known error they're fixing. Yeah, Twitch was apparently having all kinds of issues earlier today. Um, like with the chat. Like people were streaming and like just dropping frames even though their internet was fine and like the chat was turning on and off and on and off. Um I haven't seen go. any of those types of issues, but I'm sure what you're experiencing with the bits right now is related. Bits were working at the beginning of the stream. For what that's worth. <laughs> Which isn't much, we're trying to use them now. <laughs> Alright. So I think it's like this part of Makalania. Oh, let me save first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I can just run around here. Okay, so some snow wolves. Where's my mouse? There it is. We got some snow wolves and we got some ice flans. I should have used Waka for that ice plan. <clears throat> yeah, I'm I'm sure it is a known error and they're working on it. Yeah, but if y'all want if y'all want anything down there, well, except really the sound effect. I know there's timing involved in that. But like other stuff, just tell me and I'll make it happen. <clears throat> Not super worried about the bits. You know what I'm saying? Okay, let's go ahead and save. So this is no Ice Flan. We've got a snow wolf and an evil eye. Aw. I would think that his is enough. But I guess not. His accuracy is enough to catch that, but I guess not. I think hopefully mock debts are here too, because that's an enemy in this area that I need to get. So hopefully they're around here. We can't go too far down here because we'll run into Dark Shiva. Um, if we go actually like to the temple, I think, or close to it. And we don't want to run into any Dark Aeons. Y'all have seen how well that goes, which is not well. I can't remember exactly how far down I can go if, if Dark Shiva's like all the way at the temple or if there's, if it's like before the temple. <laughs> Would smash the jelly blob. Yeah, I mean, I'm definitely smash on most of the jelly blobs. I think the ice one's Piece good. The fire one's good, the water one's good. I don't know about the lightning one. Not as interested in that. But uh, definitely Smash. She was before the temple, I think. Okay. Thank you, Nixon C. So, I won't go too far down there. Let's see if I can go into this screen at all. I bet I have to run along here a little bit for the moth debts. They're probably not up at the front. So you think she's like somewhere along this little run right here? Oh, there's a moth debt. Perfect! So that's an ice flan. Snow wolf. 
and a moth debt. Farewell. I was lurking when the kittens were making trouble. That's what did they destroy on the bed? A stuffle. <laughs> it was a cat toy. It, it's still there. Um, <sighs> this is what it is now. It was like a fluffy ball with like a bunch of these sparklies coming off all, all, all over it, and now it's barely any smart sparklies and the fluff is not a ball anymore. So, um, both of the kittens, but Lady especially, really loves, like, shiny, sparkly things. That is her absolute favorite. So, um, when she was being super hyper before stream, I got her one of her sparkly toys to distract her. And it worked really, really well. Um, she stopped destroying my stuff, so, you know, success. Um, and then she absolutely destroyed the fluffy ball. Yeah, it's a fluffy corpse now. It will it will have to go into no the fluffy garbage. <laughs> I don't think I'm letting her keep it. <laughs> it's, it's totally trashed. But she has lots of others. Like we have a big old bin of cat toys. Um, this is, you know, with four cats, we we get that as gifts a lot of times from family and stuff. So, um, no, we don't hit Kamari. Hit the evil eye. So we have a ton. I'm sure that there is probably like just an identical one in a different color. <laughs> in the house somewhere that I can give her. It's probably like a blue one and a yellow one somewhere. Maybe even another pink one. Who knows? But because they're kittens and they're so young and, you know, I raise them, they demand attention like all the freaking time. And sometimes it's like really difficult distracting at work. So I have like, I bring a couple of the t toys in here to throw them um, so that they don't mess me up at work. <laughs> I mean, most people enjoy seeing them on the camera. Like it's not normally like a big problem, but it's still like very distracting. So I'd prefer to not have that. Like, they can be distracting for a minute, and then no they need to go waste. away. But go. they want to be distracting for, like, an hour and a half, and that's just not going to work. I have shit to do. <laughs> I don't think my boss would be too happy if she found out that instead of doing work, I was just playing with the kittens for an hour and a half. <laughs> I don't, I just somehow don't think that that would go over super well. No, stop targeting Kimari. There we go. All right, two evil eyes, and this moth debt. Farewell. Yeah, I've got some That's other, there's a little mouse up there that I haven't thrown yet. Rarely are kittens good for work productivity. Well, when they're not like super hyper and they just want to cuddle, it's not a problem because then they just climb in my lap and they go to sleep, it's not a big deal. The problem is, is when they're hyper and they want to interact with me because then they're like demanding attention and stuff and it's like oh <laughs> like guys i have to do stuff to get paid so that you can eat <laughs> but they don't understand because they're kittens farewell no time to waste let's go All right, so we need one more snow wolf. We need five more evil eyes, three more ice flans, and four more moth deaths. There's another ice flan. This should be our last snow wolf that we need. And then let's get that moth debt. No time to waste. Let's go. Let's go. If you were on TikTok, you could see cats that learn how to talk with word buttons. I have seen that. There's um, there's some cats and there's uh, there's some dogs that do it too. It's uh, it's really it's really freaking interesting. Um, watching that happen. I definitely think even though, like cats and dogs and stuff can't talk, you know, like they can't talk in the way that humans do. Um, like there's no. There's no evidence that animals do like baby babble and things like that, right? That that are essential parts of human language. That being said, 
I absolutely do think that animals um, understand human speech to some extent, even though they can't replicate it, like they can't do sentence structure and things like that. Like they can learn a lot of words, like more words than you would necessarily think with normal cat and dog commands and stuff like that. But yeah, I think they have the capacity to learn way more words than we give most of them credit for. I think a lot of animals are like that, not just domesticated ones, you know? I think this might be the last ice flame that we need. It's over. It's over. Okay, so we just need evil eyes and moth deaths now. It's another moth dead. Yep, capture limit reach. You can find lots of huskies on TikTok who actually kind of talk. Oh yeah, because <laughs> they're how with their howling they can actually like mimic human sounds. <laughs> I love those videos. Um, you can find those a lot of those on YouTube too. I love those. <laughs> they're like, I love you. <laughs> it cracks me up. And like, of course, if I if I had a dog that howled like that. I would definitely train it to always make the I love you howls and things. 100% because it's fucking adorable. <laughs> okay. Definitely still need some moth debts. We need two more moth debts and three more evil eyes. Farewell. <clears throat> that's how it's done. I need that group again that's like the two evil eyes and the moth debt together. Give me some of that game. Come on, RNG. Come on, RNG. Give it to me. Oh well, another mop dead. Do you have any dogs or cats, um, Nixon C? Katie has lots of cats too. Kitty cat person, for sure. Oh, I think that's the last moth that we need. We just need to find evil eyes now. Enough. Oh, the last one was the last one we need. That's okay. No I miscounted a little. Let's go. Come to me, evil eyes. This is the first um, stream in a while where we haven't played any Blitzball, but I just didn't know how long it was going to take to do the butterfly mini game. So I was like, I don't want to open up with a Blitzball game like I normally do. I'll, be I'll right have to back. play some more Blitzball next time. Maybe I'm going to get myself a puppy soon, but I'm too busy at the moment. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, puppies are a lot of work. Um, I definitely think a, a, out of all the animals I've ever had, which I've had lo several different kinds of animals, <laughs> um, out of all of them, I would say so the easiest the animals time. are adult cats. And with these kittens, like, we ended up with the kittens on accident. <laughs> like, it wasn't on purpose. I typically adopt adult animals. Um, so I don't have a lot of experience with the with the kittens and puppies and stuff like that. But I, puppies are definitely a lot of work. I won't go so easy on you next time. But good luck when you do get a puppy. We also also, um always adopt from shelters because there's so many and they need good homes, you know? An evil eye! Hell yeah! No worries. Yeah. Farewell. Yep, we need two more of those guys. So I want to get... It's hopefully done. it'll pop up with the group that's like the two evil eyes and the moth dead. 
and then we can get them. And be done with this little area. You hear somebody meowing at you. I don't see them. <laughs> There's another evil eye. Okay. We should only need one more. Hopefully I didn't miscount. <laughs> End of game. End of game. There we go, two evil eyes, fabulous. This will definitely get us enough. Why are you farming the same monsters? Oh, it's the for the monster capturing mini game. So we're doing all the end game stuff. End of game. You, you get ten of each, ten of each monster for the arena to unlock everything. But we are done with this area now. So we're gonna go unlock something fun. The final showdown. Let's go to the calm lands. Yo, we're gonna get we're gonna finish two celestial weapons this stream. Yes, yeah, yeah, the arena, exactly. But getting all those Makalani ones, that should have unlocked the tenth thing. So we're gonna get we're gonna finish two celestial weapons this stream, so that's wonderful. Yeah, where I am right now in the game, Nixon C is um we have gotten to the part where we've unlocked Sin. We haven't gone inside Sin at all yet, but I stopped there when we got the airship and uh, started doing the celestial weapons. So that's what we've been doing the last several streams is all the various things to collect the celestial weapons. Yeah, there's the Makalania unlock. Want to take a swing at it? No. Not for free. Yes, I know. You have to make a living, too. So you've been capturing Iron Giants, eh? Um, I thought... I think I have ten. So you've caught some Horned Beasts. Hmm. I thought once you got ten, that's what unlocked the sigil. Maybe not. Let's see. What's unlocked in here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hmm, I thought it was ten. Is it more? Let's see. Maybe now what? Okay. I can't choose now what? <laughs> Why is that there if I can't choose it? Hmm. I thought once I did ten things that would unlock Orin's sigil. Is it that I have to do ten fights? Hang on. Hang on, let's Google this. Unlock any combination of ten area or species bosses at the monster arena. Da, da, da. Oh, so those two that I have... Those two that I have that are the extra ones, they don't count. So we have to do two more. Okay, understood. So we're not quite there yet. We're not quite there yet. We have to unlock two more area or species. That's fine. Alright. Let's go back to that little area to get the rest of the smiggers that we did not get last time. The final showdown. All right, let's go to the moon flow because we were in the right spot. They, those go. guys are just apparently super rare. I did the same, got two save files. I stopped right before sin and started farming all the celestial weapons plus the omega ruins. Yep. 
And I know I can go into Sin and go a little farther before it's like the point of no return. So at some point I'll stop and do that. But I was like, I want to try to get all the celestial weapons and like have those when I go inside Sin if possible. Oh, and let's do this so we can get there faster. Since this is the PC version, we can turn off encounters. So let's turn off the encounters, get to that spot we were before where the Smiggards are and capture the rest of them. So it was that little, it was that little junction that's up here where you go one way to Moonflow and the other way to Jose Temple. That is where you get those birds. It's that one little spot and they are just that rare. So yeah, um, Nix and see what we've been doing. In addition to those, we've also been getting, watching all the um, like Jet Braska Oren Spheres, those. So we watched all of those. We never could, um, we can't get into Bisset to watch that one though, of course, because Dark Valifor stops me. So at some point, maybe I'll have to fight Dark Valifor, like get high enough level to, to fight Dark Valifor or something. <laughs> um, I don't know how that's going to go because I really wanted to show that scene on stream, but there's no way to get it without Dark Valifor unless like you backtrack all the way from like the Makalania Calmlands area, like backtrack back to Bisset. And... Um, I'm not going to do all that. That's like way too much. So I waited for the airship, but of course, when you get, by the time you get the airship, Dark Balafor is spawned, so. <clears throat> Unfortunate. Ah, there's one right now. Fabulous. That's what I needed. Woo-ha. Yes, I've already captured all the rest of these. I know, I know. That's how it's done. I need to get Titus in here so I can run, because I only need to fight him if it's got one of those birds. I won't go so easy on you next time. Whatever you say, Titus. Whatever you say. Yeah, so they're literally just like, just right here, and that's the only spot that these guys spawn. Apparently, I did some, I did some googling. I won't go so easy on you next time. I wanted to get this get the sphere as well. I didn't know Valifor was waiting for me. <laughs> I summoned Mo Jojimbo and he did the job. Oh, nice. Yeah, I haven't gotten any of the extra Aeons yet. That's coming up soon. I'm gonna get those. I do want to do that as well. Um, but, uh, yeah. I mean, if there's a way to cheese it with Yojimbo, then maybe I'll do that. I don't know. So, uh, somebody must have that strap posted somewhere, I guess. Oh, there we go. There's another birdie. Woo-ha! Enough. All right, two more of those birds. That's how it's done. Was it just like, um, Nixon? See, when you did it, was it just like you had a lot of gill, so you were able to cheese it with his, what you call it thing? His big that attack. Won't go so easy on you next time. All right, they're popping up way better than they were last time we were in this little area. Last stream. All right, just need one more. My Titus does 999 damage, but I stopped playing Final of Face 10 because I had no time. Oh. <laughs> I paid him 40k guild, gotcha. Well, it's just, it's been a while since I played this game. So this is my first playthrough on the HD remaster version. But I've played this a ton of times on various systems um, ever since the day it came out. <laughs> uh, back in the early 2000s. So the first time I played it was like the original PlayStation 2 version. Back in the day. I'll 
be right back. All right, one more. Come on, one more birdie. One more birdie. The more often he plays Yojimbo, the higher the chance. Yeah, he one hits everything. True, very true. I am gonna get. I'm definitely gonna go get him at some point during the Final Fantasy X streams. That is on the list. All right, this should be the last bird. I get nervous, so I think I'm probably gonna go find one more just to make sure I didn't like miscount, and it gives me the message. You know what I mean? Yeah, let's find one more. I'm too nervous not to. <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay, the butterfly minigame really took... Okay, good, capture limit reach. The butterfly minigame really took a lot less time than I thought it would, so... Um, let's see, what else can we do? What else can we do this stream? Let's see. Let's get, oh, I guess the save point, the closest save point would be down here. Let's turn off encounters. Okay. No, I just, oh, it's on frequent. <laughs> Oops. I pressed it once right instead of twice. There we go. Now it's off. Okay, let's run this way while I kind of figure out what we're going to do next. Let's see. What other areas do we have to catch stuff in? Maybe we can do some more monster catching? <laughs> Let's see. What else we got? We could go do some catching in the calm lands. We only caught like a few of each one there when we had to do it when we were in there earlier to start the quest. We can do that. We can do that, we can do that. The final, final showdown, showdown with Shin. Shin. I say let's get this, get show, this on show on the road. Yeah, let's go to let's go do some catching in calm lands. Here we go. All right. I'm just updating my notes so that I can see how many of the things I've caught before. Okay, let's go to this area back here that we like to go and we'll do some catching. All right, anacondars. Two of those. Boom. Oh! Orin heals them. That's not good. I guess lightning heals them. No bueno, no bueno. Oh, that was super rude. Alright. Let's... Soft. Probably switch him out for Yuna so that I have a healer in the party and I can also see. Oh my god! Stop stoning him! So rude. Alright. I'm gonna switch Orin out for Yuna. And that way I have a healer here. We have some people with some sphere points. Let's let's do let's go do our sphere grid. Actually, it's been a while because we've been doing the monster capturing, so there just hasn't been we've not been gaining a lot of spheres. I 
Remember when we were going through the story and we used to end, end our streams with doing the sphere crit? <laughs> good times, good times. What is this? This is strength. How much, how many level? I only have two. No, we're not going to bother. Riku has some. What is this ability? This is, oh, bribe. Okay, cool. Yeah, okay. Let's do Kimari's. I'm taking him down Waka's path. So that's what he's doing. Getting some more nice accuracy. And Waka gets some really useful abilities. In my opinion. What's this? This is Sentinel. Okay. Anyway, we got them all there. They're things. Or was it 120k? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Not sure myself. Two anacondars. Okay. Why don't you, Kira? Oh, I meant to cure a Titus, not Waka. Oops. That's okay. Well, at least he didn't stone Yuna. Where's Esuna? There it is. Hiya! Alright, let's cure a Titus this time. That's what I meant to do before. It's over. It's over. I'm good, yeah? Yeah, you're pretty good, Waka. That's why I use you a lot. You get nice crits. Nice, nice crits. Nice crits, baby. Ding 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 da ding ding. Malbro! I hate these. Yeah. Ha! Oh, why doesn't Titus damage it? Oh, because he's got water. Water and ice don't damage. So we'll bring in Kimari. Because he's doing electric. This is awful. Mm. Why don't you Let's see? Remedy on Yuna.
All right, Kimari's going next, so Estuna on him. Oh, why doesn't he do damage either? Oh, he's ice. Orin is lightning. Oh my god. I, <laughs> I totally messed up this little battle. I need Orin in here, not Kimari. All right, come on, Orin. This ends now. As you progress, of course, this monster capturing takes longer and longer because you're working with enemies that actually can do a little bit of damage to you. So, very, very annoying. Alright, let's remedy Yuna. Oh, this thing would have been dead by now if I uh, was paying more attention. <laughs> uh, but I only pay attention on the boss battles, you'll know that. Everybody's healed up. And I'll do the Marlboro the right way next time. <laughs> uh. Oh, okay. So we have here... Let's see. We have a Flame Flan. And we have a Nabros. That's what the Wasps are called. And then... What's this little guy called? Shred. Okay. And then a Shred. I need to bring in Titus to get the flame plan. No, who has ice? Kimari has ice. Titus has water, so I need to bring in Kimari to get that flame plan. All right, come here, Kimari. No, there we go. Hmm. Yeah, ice, and that's what Kimari has. Okay. Lulu, you can come do a small ice Let's spell on it to get it down. But don't kill it! Oh my gosh. Target the flame flan! Okay. He's got 1,000. Let's just do a little blizzard and see how what that does. Okay. That killed it. Good job. Not what I wanted to do. So I really cannot use her. She's too strong. She's too strong for monster capturing. Ooh, chimeras. Okay. 9,800. Well, maybe she can help here. Mm, what would be good against them? Not fire or water. Let's do Lazara. Okay, good, and she didn't kill it. All right. Chimera brain captured. Is 
it nice to be back in the fight, Lulu? I knew you couldn't help for a while because the enemies we were doing were too weak. Farewell. The kittens are back. <laughs> it's time to play. Okay. Well, come here, Riku. You can dismantle these. Riku's back. And then this is a Queerl. Don't kill it. Good job. Oh, that's annoying. Good job, guys. Good job. You got the cool hero. Alright. Let's do maybe one more group and then we'll go back to the save sphere. Oh, two anacondars. Alrighty. That's almost all of those that I need. Alright, let's get somebody strong. So we can't have, so plus lightning. Okay, no, so this is fine. Oh yeah! Oh, yeah. oh cause that means heal. Thur. Oh my god. Plus is not more damage, plus is healing them. Anyway, it's okay, Walka took them out. Yeah! <laughs> okay, let's head back. Let's head back to the safe spot. All right, so... Oh, another fight. Oh, another Marlboro. Okay, I'm gonna do it right this time. <laughs> Let's get unit in here so I can look at it, refresh my memory on what elements right. we need. Okay, so we need fire and lightning. So that's exactly who we have, okay. So let's Kiraga on Orin. And let's destroy this bitch. Maybe we can destroy it before it bad breasts me this time. Now that I'm doing it the right way. Go ahead, Yuna, just attack. With your 33 damage. Good job. You're helping. Okay, don't bad breath me. You bad breathed me. <gasps> I told you not to! Malbro! My god! Alright, let's remedy on Yuna. Oh, good job, Orin. Oh, but you missed. So, not good job. Bad job. Mm, does he have darkness? Yeah, he's afflicted with darkness. Okay. <clears throat> Go ahead and remedy yourself. Kiraga on Waka. Orin will be okay for a little bit longer. Oh, and then he's dead. We almost Missing killed him game. before he bad breathed. Almost. Not quite. Okay, back to the save spot for real now. Mm. 
made it. All right. So next stream, we are going to be going to Beaconel, and we're going to do the Cactuar um, mini game there and work on getting Riku's ultimate weapon. So that's going to be the goal for next stream. I don't think that will take very long. Like it's not, it's not hard. It's just you have to go do it, and it takes a minute. So I can actually figure out more specifically how long that one will take, and uh, we can probably play some Blitzball next time. Actually. <laughs> All right, so let me switch over. Webcam only. Goodbye game. Let's find somebody to raid. All right, thank you guys so much for coming to the stream. Um, it's been awesome. It's been awesome. Uh, so I talked about what we're doing for the next Final Fantasy X stream. That's on next Thursday. On next Saturday's stream, we are going to be talking about habits that kill your roleplay experience while we play some Sims 2. So it's going to be a Sims 2 stream with Landon, Interstage Window like normal, and the topic is habits that kill your roleplay experience. So it's going to be things, you know, I've talked about on Spare Room before, so it's like, you know, when people try too hard to be unique, when they try to bring unnecessary competition into roleplay... Things, things like that. We're going to talk about all that stuff. All that stuff. Basically, bad roleplay thought patterns. So that's what we're going to do. Um, okay, let me put my socials into the chat. So follow me on all the socials. Um, do the Patreon. Subscribe to my Twitch, etc. Oh, wait, it's not working. That's right, because the chat's broken right now. Oh, wait, no, there it goes. <laughs> okay, I'm also um, decently active on Twitter. I mean, you all know how it works. I do this the same way that every other content creator does it. All right, we are going to raid Venom today. He's playing Devil May Cry 5. Some very smashable monsters in that believe it all right there we go okay so while that's counting down thank you guys so much for coming with me to the stream today on the butterfly mini game adventure i was able to beat it thank god <laughs> and um of course as always y'all don't forget to make it a great day all right let's go raid venom say hi to him <laughs>